The last day of the Seve Trophy for 2007. At the start of it, the continent of Europe, nine and a half points to eight and a half. It was nicely poised, but uh, perhaps the performance of the GB&I side typified by this man's name. Storming along they were. Graham Storm, second at the fifth en route to his win. The biggest win by the GB&I side, six and five over Thomas Bjorn, who's not been feeling well all week. Storm the victor there. Second match out, Paul Casey, birdie chance at the sixth. And that typified his performance. Casey overcoming Raphael Jackland, three and two. Only Montgomery, no points at all going into this opening match of the day. Monty versus Carlson. And Monty's second shot at the fifth. Also very typical of his round. So the two heavyweights there, Monty versus Carlson. It all came down to the last hole. Indeed, the last putt. Monty to win, one up. So the first three matches went the way of GB and I. Momentum was with them very much all day long. Marcus Breer, second shot to the 18th. In match number seven, Breer playing against Philip Archer, one of the stalwarts of the GB and I side, and that cost him, well, not them the match, but it, in the end, it was a half. Archer and Breer halved. And all day long, the GB and I side were winning all over the board. Peter Hansen from Sweden, the only light on the continental European side. Ferdi Pat the first, and he was the only win in the end. GB and I side won eight points, and the continent of Europe, two. Two matches were halved, and only one win by the continental Europe. Justin Rose, an intriguing match with Miguel Angel Jimenez. He finished in the end, two and one victor, and it was a very happy Nick Falder who accepted the Seve Trophy. The end of the week.